After finding out that the new arrival's fate is in their hands, the two islands are facing a huge decision. God, this is horrible. I actually feel sick. They must choose whether they want Josh or Casey to join their tribe. As you guys know, um, I got on well with Casey. I just think he has a really good energy. But to win them, their choice must match the new arrivals. I feel quite confident that Casey would pick up. So, what are we saying, Tigers? Do you want Josh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> OK, just from that reaction, yeah, it's really No, it's not a selfish decision here, though. I just feel like... Listen, I think it just makes um, sense. It's, it's like yeah, a competition yeah. perspective. It yeah. makes yeah. sense. Like, case is a risk. <sighs> you ever think in it? Who do you like more, Josh or Casey? I like Casey more. I've not been able to get a conversation out of Josh whatsoever. I think he's boring. Josh and Casey have made their choices, and so have we. Casey, please reveal the tribe you wish to join and explain why. After today, my mind was made up and I'd said and I knew that I wanted to go for this tribe. Maybe they haven't put me, or maybe they have, but I'm gonna stay true to myself and what I've said, I believe in. So, the tribe that I'd like to be a part of is... Tigers. If the Tigers have picked Casey, he joins the tribe. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. If the Tigers haven't picked Casey, he's going home. Josh. Casey, the tribe you hope to join has rejected you. A boat will arrive shortly to collect you. Sorry, brother. It's fine. Don't worry. It's my pleasure. I've only known Casey for, like, 24 hours, but, like, just sending someone home, it's just so horrible. And I bonded with him and, like, I knew what his intentions are and he had so many, like, aspirations. And, like, this was, like, the beginning of his journey and, like, just to be responsible for, like, ruining this for him is just the hor it's a horrible feeling. You're playing a very good game, darling. Oh, my God. Babe, mm -hmm. I fought for you. I was crying, babe. Like, That's fine. I was outnumbered. Well, yeah. That's fine, don't worry. I think you're doing a very good game, so yeah, yeah. just keep that up. Wow. OK. That's so nasty. <laughs> Having been called out by Casey, Big T is after some answers. I'm going to be really honest with you. The fact that you didn't say goodbye to me just then, and you said, Oh, I think you're playing a good game. Can you explain what you meant? Yeah, I can. I think you are very disingenuous. And I just get a vibe off you that I think is just really fake. And I think the persona of Big T is really fake and not really you. Like, when Josh was going, you were all over him going, oh, don't wear those shorts, don't wear this spray. You didn't... You haven't really spoke to Josh at all. You certainly didn't care about him like that. It is what it is. You're going home, have fun. I will. Him. And you're staying because you're fake. Well, you're not on the island anymore, so ciao. And you're a fake fucking bitch. Casey's behaviour sort of shocked me. And to leave this process making someone else feel really bad about themselves, for me, it's tit for tat. Please. Please. Oh, what the fuck is wrong with people? Oh. <laughs>